Hi, I'm Mark Pagani. I'm a photographer based in New Orleans, and I'm filming a documentary about the process of climbing a really big granite wall in Yosemite National Park. It's called El Capitan. I'm gonna need your help to do that. In addition to my wedding photography business here in New Orleans, I also shoot a lot of adventure travel photography, and I've been rock climbing and mountaineering for about 20 years. I have a book out called Fearless Photographer Travel, and there's an entire chapter devoted to climbing and mountaineering photography. When I started out in photography, I was, and still am, a big fan of Ansel Adams' early work in Yosemite National Park. The first time I traveled there in 1995, I stood in the middle of the valley in awe of the huge monoliths towering above me, Half Dome on the right and El Capitan, the captain, on the left. As I got more into climbing, I marveled at the stamina and courage it must take to climb big walls like El Capitan. Since that first visit to Yosemite, I've rock climbed in places like Potrero Chico, Mexico, Cat Ba Island, Vietnam, Joshua Tree, California, in Belize and Patagonia. I've been to Mount Everest twice and I've climbed mountains in the French Alps, Bolivia, Patagonia, Nepal, the United States, Mexico, Argentina, and Iceland. Throughout my climbing career, I've always had a dream of climbing the ultimate big wall, El Capitan. It rises 3,000 feet above the valley floor and it is a monster. In order to do this, I'm going to need some help. So I contacted my friend and world-renowned climber, Timmy O'Neill, to see if he would be interested in helping me achieve this goal. And he said yes. Timmy has climbed around the world and is featured in many movies about rock climbing and high altitude climbing and is sponsored by the clothing company Patagonia. And he's well known on the motivational speaker circuit. He held the previous record for speed climbing of the nose route of El Capitan. We set our start date for October 3rd and I decided that my four month long journey to Yosemite and onto the wall should be documented so that others who share this goal, this dream, can get a little taste of what it's like. I also want to focus on the amazing beauty of Yosemite and hopefully remind people that as our natural environment continues to change, so will our experience of these great outdoor spaces. And in viewing the movie, I hope people are not only inspired to actually chase a dream, but on a much simpler level, just to get outside and see some beautiful stuff. The documentary called El Capitan Rise will give a viewer a taste of the mental and physical preparation involved in an undertaking like this, as well as plenty of documentary dramatic footage of the 3,000 foot climb itself. We're anticipating being on the wall for five days and four nights, with a fifth night spent on the summit, if all goes according to plan. I'll be trying not to completely freak out as I spend my nights on a six foot nylon and aluminum perch called a portal edge, worried about the multiple thousand foot drop below me. All of this costs money, of course, and I've set my goal at $10,000. The money will be used in several ways. Some goes to Timmy for his expertise and his ability to keep us safe and focused, and the rest will pay for a big wall aid climbing training course near Seattle in August, um, as well as specialized climbing gear, lodging, airfare to Seattle and California, as well as supplies for the climb itself. So you may be asking, what do I get out of this if I donate? It's a good question. I've got a ton of great perks and they're all listed in the Indiegogo page. If you donate anything, you're going to be listed in the final credits of the movie. If you do donate a higher amount, you will also have the opportunity to own a print from my huge travel and or climbing photography archive. Um, you can also own a print from the actual climb itself of El Capitan. For instance, if you donate $50, you'll receive a print that's worth 200 bucks. It's a pretty good deal. So whether you donate or not, thank you so much for taking the time to watch this movie. And if you happen to think of it in early October, please send some good vibes over to California because I'm going to need all the help I can get. Thanks so much.